Trying to find officials has been an ongoing issue for the PIAA, but thanks to this new recruitment camp, administrators from school districts around the area say they are finally seeing more interest. With spring sports just around the corner, a recruitment effort is underway at Carbondale Area High School to help bolster the area's roster of referees. We want to keep the integrity of the game intact with having the right amount of officials covering these contests. It's really important. This is for City Regional School District Athletic Director Brian Durkin's fourth time holding a recruitment camp to bring in new PIAA officials for the Lackawanna Interscholastic Athletic Association. For years, the PIAA has struggled with staffing numbers for all sports, something Durkin says he's seen firsthand. Some of the lacking of officials throughout the region is due to COVID. Uh, they just haven't come back uh, like we expected them to. But Durkin says what was once a struggle to find officials is now getting a little easier. Since starting the recruitment seminars, he says the PIAA has seen roughly 150 new officials like North Pocono High School student Emily Bico. She's registered for the PIAA Junior Official Program. I just like playing basketball. I like watching it, especially like my sister's games. So I wanted to start like that thing. I applaud the uh, athletic directors, you know, taking the time to get to put this together to get more and more people, make it easier to get people involved. As a PIAA official for more than 35 years, David Elliott was one of several advisors on hand to help new members take their registration test. He says although the job has its ups and downs, it's a great way to learn about the game. I, I just really enjoy sports. You know, somebody who wasn't that good at it, you know, th this is my way of staying involved in it and, uh, you know, keeping active. While recruitment numbers are going up, the PIAA is still looking for football officials for the upcoming spring sports seasons. Jack Colkin, Newswatch 16, Scott and Lisa, back to you. All right.